I'm very forgetful today. I was trying to remember what kind of potatoes I'm making. I'm making scallop potatoes. And we're, go we're going to put, we have put, some cream of chicken soup. Oh God, I will say cream of chicken. Cream of mushroom soup. The big can is equal to two tins of cream of mushroom soup. Then I added one tin of water and one tin of milk, or a cup of milk, you could even say. And then I added onion. Well, I'll have the recipe on the bottom. Then we have, we're going to put some butter in there, like just like a tablespoon maybe of butter. Right here I have the, the chicken, see, sauce. I tell you, it's the first day with my new mate. <laughs> Instant stop, stop. Stock mix. <laughs> For this, I'm going to use a teaspoon. <laughs> and then we're going to put some pepper. And I'm going to door, see if I can find my tongue because he ran away. Anyways, this is too funny. Okay. I'm not going to add any salt because I think with this and the butter. There's going to be salt in the butter. I think I'm going to try that and we have pepper so then we'll add it like if we need it we'll add it to our bowl. So I have potatoes of course and like I said I've already sliced my onions very thinly and the potatoes like I do this. You can do chunks it's up to you but it, at the end it'll be lovely even if I can't remember what it's called. So then we're going to start up our pot and we're going to say gonna... three minutes. This is a learning experience for me too because this is a new pot. I've, I've cooked in a couple times. I already cooked a ham in there. We're having scalloped potatoes and a ham. The ham is already cooked. It came out so nicely. Okay. Okay, this is our finished product. Now I put cheese in the pot. I added about a half a cup of water with three tablespoons of flour. I took the sauce out of there and I put it into a wok and I brought it to a boil and then I added some, like I said, the thickening to it. And it came out like this, it's lovely. I've added cheese in there, but now when I put it on my plate, I will add some more cheese on top. So, I hope you enjoy this recipe, even if I did talk with two tongues before. Enjoy!